Hi there, this is Maggie from Rock Paper Copy and you can find us on www.rockpapercopy.com We can help you with reviewing your website design, we can help you with search engine optimization and social media marketing. And in this video I am reviewing a website Vero Echo and I'm on the homepage and I really like the logo, I love the colors that you keep the colors within black and green and the, the what I can see that you try to include plenty of products, too many products on one image and it's simply people can't see the details. It will be difficult for you to convert with showing too many details within one image. So I would recommend maybe um, featuring one product or one type of product within one image and then explain more about each product. It will help you convert better because at the moment people really don't see, can't see what it says on each individual product and as soon as they get to grips what are you trying to portray with this image and with these products the image will change so I do not recommend adding too many products for example this image is much more better when it comes to conversion because it focuses on one message and people are um, can engage with this image because it shows the face and it has got a short tagline and call to action which is great Scrolling down, uh, I understand that you are showing the blog because okay, you're showing products and the blog post. The images aren't as engaging as I would love to see on the home page because you really want to show the images that are almost irresistible to click. So make sure to, to work on the images and perhaps don't feature blog as high on the home page because blog is just an addition and you are here to sell so definitely I do encourage you to to show individual collections here and and then link to these collections okay you've got your featuring candles and the new year's sale which is great you're linking to candles there is another, uh, well, there is a featured image, so that's great. So I have I have more idea as to what you are selling. So with the first image, I've seen the garden products, as I understand. From this blog, I have absolutely no idea what will I find unless I spend more time reading the titles, which not everybody is prepared. I just only see that it's sale and that someone is exercising, so I understand you're having sales on health products. Um, this image isn't that clear because I don't see the candles yet, it just it is not very clear for a first time visitor. So I definitely would work on improving these images now you're you're showing me tea then you're showing me soaps and other products so it would be great to maybe narrow your niche or maybe define your niche more effectively because i understand that you are still within this the same niche maybe health products but define it a little bit better have a stronger message when it comes to what what do you portray with your brand the products are displayed very well, um, the images, some of them are cut, as you see at the top, is cropped too much, this is too small. I recommend showing only three images in a row because this way your images will be um, a little bit bigger and it will be clearer at the moment. For example, I don't see what this label says on this image, I see a little bit more. If you have three products in a row instead of five, you will see the conversion goes a little bit higher because at the moment when you are showing so many products at once, people are a little bit discouraged, maybe overwhelmed with which product they want to um, they want to click so it's a little bit too much for a first-time visitor so I always recommend 
displaying three products in a row and maybe showing only three rows on the home page because this is just enough to to encourage visitor uh, to click further and to ignite some kind of um, attention uh, so don't overwhelm but maybe just show a little bit less but then invite people to click further to find out more okay featured collections it looks a little bit like featured blog uh, because I don't see clearly what each product says. Maybe in children, you've got candles here, household supplies, shows the garden. This shows also the garden, but I understand you're, um, you're selling soap. So the images aren't as clear as I would love to see for a store that converts well. So definitely, um, don't be too inventive with your images be bold simple and direct with the images it will definitely help you um, improve your conversion okay shop with confidence that's also a great addition because um, it builds trust so the, the more people trust your store um, the more they likely to spend money with you so this is great Okay, the extra page is about us page. Okay, I like that because I can see that you've got some kind of messages that you try to follow, which is great. You've got internal links here. I would definitely, um, I would definitely encourage you to add maybe a photo of your team, a photo of your store or, or a warehouse. If you do have something like that, it definitely will um, help you build trust and convert more. But otherwise than that, uh, your page, this, this page looks great and it is SEO friendly, which is fantastic. Why shop at Vero Echo? This is fantastic page. I love the shops that include this kind of information. When it comes to internal links, I always encourage people to add more descriptive text because it's more SEO friendly than just using here for internal link. Um, add more, maybe change those headings into SEO friendly hashtags and on our website www.rockpapercopy.com under learn you will be able to find a very friendly video tutorial how to completely SEO your Shopify pages it shows you step by step how to add and optimize each page so how to add hash tags which are those tags how to make them SEO friendly how to add and optimize internal links and also how to optimize images and any other elements on the page Okay, return policy. Okay, so this is part of shipping policy, understand. So that's great, you've got plenty of information here. With the shipping policy, I would love to see maybe the rate table at the very top so people don't have to spend, uh, spend more time than necessary looking for the info. So put, put this kind of very user-friendly a table with the rates at the top and whether you show a ship internationally on or within your country so that would be great um, okay you've got this info here as well so 595 flat rate shipping so that's great free shipping on orders over 50 so that's fantastic but some people might not notice it straight away so once they click on the shipping it's it would be a great idea to add it here as well at the top okay contact us great you've got a standard message i can see that you have spent quite a long time optimizing this page this this website which is great I would love to see the in uh, the professional email address here and hyperlinked so people some some people prefer using um, their own uh, email account to email they don't like using the these these message forms so if you give people few ways to contact you you will definitely convert better now when it comes to shop Okay, I will click on the collection page. 
too much text, too much text. I want to see the products right away. I don't want to scroll through the blocks of other images, blocks of text. This is really not necessary on a collection page and it can significantly um, affect your conversion rate, which is sales. Okay, you've got definitely fewer product, fewer items in a row than on the home page. You've got only four items in a row, which is great, but I also encourage you to display three. Okay, personal care and you are... I'm not sure if, if I would put all this information under personal care. Can you see what's going on? People have to go through. I have never seen this before. 231 pages. Do you think people will want to go through all these pages? I recommend definitely adding more, more structure when it comes to your navigation because this is just unimaginable for any any shopper. And if if I was given this kind of this kind of collection page with 231 pages, I would simply click this little X here and go to other page that is more user friendly so definitely you would have to work on making the store journey and finding the the appropriate product a little bit more effective so this 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 is something major that that you have to work on you've got product type here which is great but I would definitely encourage you to have more defined structure because even with hand and body lotions I still get 221 product so I'm guessing it's about 10 pages to go through no I'm wrong it's 19 pages so you definitely need more uh, more structure and if it involves reducing the products or organizing them better I definitely do encourage you to do that because you will find it very hard making sales from the website as it is right now so yeah definitely work on this and please feel free to email me uh, if you need more help as to how to organize your website because I do help online stores to convert better I do help organizing um, the store navigation and the store structure so please keep in touch the website address is www.rockpapercopy.com and you can also email me under about us page simply click email and there is my email address contact form so definitely do email me if you have any questions if you like this video critique and if you would like to order a critique for your own store, visit us on our website rockpapercopy.com and uh, at the top navigation click on critiques and pick a critique like video like this one or a text critique, it's only 50 US dollars and you can order it online. Thank you so much for your time, bye bye.